So we commonly get asked all the time what is the difference between our fill manager systems and our pre-line system. So today we're actually going to go through and pull these apart and actually show you the actual differences between the fill manager and the pre-line systems. So behind us we have our pre-line and we have our fill manager and we're going to go through, we're going to pull them apart and we're going to show you exactly what those differences are. So the pre-line obviously comes with the water sensor at the bottom. So that will show you, uh, will indicate to the operator of the vehicle that there is water present inside the bowl and that happens straight away and will let you know straight away. So you don't have to keep on looking in the bowl all the time every time that you stop. So it'll let you know straight away. Um, obviously there is a bit of a size difference between the two and we'll go into a little bit later and show you exactly why that size difference is there. Um, they are both 30 micron filters so they both do the exact same job and they are both designed primarily as water separators. So we're not designed, uh, we're not after the best possible particle protection, we're after water separation. So this is where the pre-line comes into its element with this new dual layer uh, media. So there is one layer which looks after the water separation and another layer which looks after particle separation. Now the fuel manager, while still is a water separator and is a very good product, it only has a single layer media and uses a proprietary uh, treatment called Aquablock by Baldwin. So where this was created uh, quite recently and is quite a new product to market. Um, so it's quite a modern product and uses a modern um, filtration media where the fuel manager has been around for quite some time. It's still a very, very good product but only uses a single stage uh, chemical treatment for water separation. We have uh, our two elements, so the bits that actually do the hard work. We have two of them here which we have previously cut open and where I'm gonna go through and show you exactly the size differences between them and what's inside these filters. So we'll open up the fill manager first. So this is all that's in it. It's not very, um, doesn't look very exciting, but this is the bit that does the job. So here we have uh, Fuel Manager's single layer treated media. And so this is the bit that does all the hard work and does all the water separation and particle separation. So we'll just put that to the side for a second and we'll have a look at the fuel, uh, the pre-line. So straight away, you can tell that there is a massive difference between the two. So you can see on the, the outside of this one how it's quite a bit lighter than the fuel manager. Uh, this white layer on the outside is actually there, is the water separation barrier. So this white layer on the outside is the bit that does all the hard work. So we're going to cut these open and I'll actually show you the difference inside them and the thickness of the media. So we have the fuel manager here, we have our knife. Remember, if you're a <laughs> If you're a child, don't cut yourself. Um, so we'll just cut some of the media out so you can have a look at it. So that's the media that's inside the fuel manager. So you can see how it's a little bit darker and lighter in spots. So that's the actual treatment and has a bit of a funky smell to it. Uh, single layer media, 30 micron, tried and true product, it's been around for a very long time. So we'll move over to our pre-line. So apart from the size differences, where uh, we'll cut this open and we'll be able to show you what the difference is on the inside. So you know the old story where they say don't judge a book by its cover? It's definitely the case with the pre-line. Oh. 
So that's that white layer that I told you about, uh, which is the water separation layer. And when I peel this open, you'll be able to see a color change. So that's the second layer, and that's the particle separation layer. So we have the water separation layer, and then the particle separation layer, and that's the dual layer media that I was explaining to you or telling you about before. So all that means is this is a much newer, technologically advanced product um, over the older fuel manager. So like uh, when you upgrade your car, it comes with uh, new bells and whistles. Um, that's exactly the same with the pre-line. What happens to the water once it's separated from the, from the element or from the fuel? What happens to that water? So what, in the fuel manager's case, it actually drains out of the bottom of the element itself here and drains into the water bowl itself. So because fuel is lighter than water, you'll actually see a separation layer uh, between the fuel and the water. So you'll be able to easily identify, or visually identify, if there's any water that has been captured in that water bowl. And if you do happen to see any water, all you do is loosen the drain cock at the bottom, quarter of the three quarters of a turn like that, drain the water out, uh, count to 10 if you can't see it, and tighten this back up. And it's as simple as that. So with the, the pre-line, it's a little bit more advanced. So you don't actually have to visually check it. You can't see what's going on inside. And because you can't see, we have a water sensor down the bottom. So this sensor actually measures the resistance difference between fuel and water. So as soon as water reaches the height of the sensor, it will notify you straight away. And same principle as the fuel manager, as soon as the alarm goes off into the cab, three quarters of a turn, count to 10, and do it back up again. And that's as simple as that. The ideal thing with this one is you don't have to keep checking it. The alarm will let you know straight away as soon as it detects any water. If the alarm keeps on repeating, you have to keep on draining it. You've obviously picked up a whole heap of water, but it's as easy as that. I hope you've uh, picked up the differences or you now know the differences between our fuel manager and our pre-line kits. And don't forget, like us on Facebook. We have our YouTube channel as well. So jump on, have a look, and um, have a great day, guys.